Hey guys, it's Christina Hathaker with Three Nights Paradise, and I'm here at Phoenix on the Bay. So essentially, right there on the other side of that trash chute sign, it's hard to see because there's a glare, is the elevator. So you're super close to the elevator. We are here at Phoenix on the Bay, 1222. It is a three bedroom, three bathroom, and it is listed for 750. And essentially, you have three en suites. So every bedroom has its own bathroom. So this bedroom has a king size bed along with its own little bathroom over here with a tub shower combo. Um, it's a very new looking tub surround. Everything in there looks very nice. However, it is the original commode and the original vanity with the culture marble top. Does look like it has an updated light fixture though. And I do really like the furniture in here. It's just very plain. It's currently on the Brett Robinson program. So it is a good rental. Um, it definitely could probably be worked a little harder. You do have a full-size washer and dryer. Get a little preview of what the color it used to be. <laughs> Dark turquoise. And then we have the second bedroom. Here also another really large room. It has a queen size bed in here, but you could easily put a king size in here and maybe even fit another twin in here if you wanted to, up against this wall where this dresser is. You also have a very large walk-in closet. And then again, it has its own ensuite. It's basically identical to the other bedroom we were just that we just saw. But this looks like an updated commode. Same vanity, same countertop, updated light fixture. We do have popcorn ceilings in here and it does look like the trim is like a cream color. So essentially you would want that to be updated at some point. Air conditioning unit looks good. Closet looks good. Hot water heater. Now this unit has not been cleaned yet, so it is a little dirty but we've got a really nice kitchen, white countertops, white appliances. Looks like they've done a little bit of kind of like a tile backsplash around the top and below the cabinets. It's got a quartz countertop. Nice frigidaire refrigerator with an ice maker. Really nice tropical view out here looking at the palm trees. I really like this floor plan because you have a designated dining space right here, as well as a wet bar. We do have a sleeper sofa in here in the living room. I do really like the furniture in here. Everything is really nice and updated. The blinds are like a bamboo, so those probably will have to be replaced. But basically you look out into the lobby area. I'm sorry. Yeah, the little lobby area right here and then the pool. And we'll look at the balcony from the bedroom so you can see a little bit more. Really like this piece of furniture. This looks really nice. I'm sure when this place is clean, it looks even better. So here's the primary bedroom. We have a king size bed in here. Again, the furniture looks really nice. Everything matches. Got a really great floor to ceiling. Set of sliders in here as well. Got a screen door on the outside too, so that you can close this and open the screen door. So kind of overlooking the fountain. This is what I was referring to as kind of a little lobby area. And then see the smaller pool, see the slide, see the lazy river, and you see the boat slips. And then beyond that, you can see the pass. And zoom in. Really large balcony, really, really nice. Let's go ahead and check out the bathroom. Well, here's a close up too of what you're working with for drapes. This is what you have in the living room too. It's 
really large closet. I'm gonna have a little area back here. You can actually turn that into another owner's closet back there. And then you've got double sinks in here, as well as a jacuzzi tub and a standalone shower. Got a little bit of extra cabinets over here. And then they also added a set right outside of here as well. So to give you another point of view, standing primary bedroom, looking out into the living room, into the hallway, the other two bedrooms, and into the kitchen.